blend up, don't blend down, you'll look way too dropped. So do this. So this is my, this is like my Thank trans, you. like, woman makeup ideal. What my own day makeup, obviously. But I blend up. Uh, There's no such thing as trans woman, it's just woman. Woman or man, make your choice and stand behind her. Uh, I'm gonna go here. We don't want all this mumbo jumbo, do we? A trans man, trans woman, this, that and the other. It's just men and women. You're either one or the other, and if you don't like being one, you can change to be the other. But you're still making a change. Thank you so much, Michelle. Thank you, babes. But sort your bits out, you know what I mean? You've got to sort your bits and pieces out. Anybody doing it? Thank you so much, Cheeky Geordie, for the five gifted subs. If you get a gifted sub off Cheeky Geordie, make sure to say thanks. Thank you, Trifles. Thank you, babe. You should, it should, you should be forced. If, you, if you're going to say you're a woman, you've got to have your bits gone. You know what I mean? And then they'd soon, soon stop them saying it, wouldn't it? When they're all losing um, petrified prawns all over the show, you know what I mean? They'd stop saying it then, wouldn't they? An operation is mandatory as soon as you say you want to be a woman. Thank you, Colette. No turning back. Give her a bit of colour. We can't have aliens walking around. And, you know what I mean? What type of life is this going to become? If we start allowing all this, you know what I mean? It's either a man or the woman. There's no no other other other, other thing to be said about it. Give her a bit of colour. Jesus Christ. And that was a bit much, but a bit much. Oh, that's, that's a bit much, isn't it? Love that. So then that's what we call when you f up your face. Don't you mean? So this is my this is like my trans woman makeup. I Looks awful. Anti EDL is not happy. Marcus Ems is not allowing her to join. <laughs> Can I just explain? Everybody thinks they're doing something to M's. Thank you so much, Becca, for the sub. Thank you, Laura Rainbow. Choo choo. Comment whenever you give a gift and then we'll pin you. They think they're spiting M's. Do you not think M's says things on purpose, knowing that if she says, everyone stop using my kitchen and making a big deal out of it, that people are not going to go and, like, use a kitchen? She's a biggest marketing genius I've ever come across in my life. She's got everybody advertising for her on their own live streams. They all know it. And every time they look at, like, Pearl's live or anyone's live, they're going to be thinking of Ems straight away. So Ems is, always, Ems is on every single live without even... while standing on her own live. So Ems is the winner. Thank you so much, y'all. Ems knows what she's doing, you know what I mean? She's smart. So all of these are just promoting for Ems. A free promotion. Thank you so much, Shireen. Because she's in everyone's mind. Uh, I don't even know if... Are you all dropped out? Uh, ah. What's your oh, most hated? Not oh mine. my god, she's so old, isn't she? Does she ever get anyone on? No, she's so old. <laughs> Marcus Sims sends flange a voice note denying doxing her address but threatens to dox flange's new number. Hey Angie, fuck no. Point of fire. You're gonna get burnt, alright? You did sit yeah. there today. You were talking about me. <coughs> you were slighting me. And uh, you talked about fucking Marcus as well. Don't sit there and say that you wasn't because you was. Alright? So I can say. Thank you so much. I want an M's top. I want a team M's top to sit with M's on my on my on my live. I need I need a team M's top or whatever top that you is with with the writing on. You know what I mean? I need to represent for M's. What's good for one is good for another. And you also sat there earlier before and started saying that I was doxing your address. And you told people to go report me. Thank you so much, everyone. Knowing full well that I hadn't doxed your address. But what I did say is this new number that you... Oh, cheeky Geordie. Thank you so much, my darling. Thank you very much for the fountain. See, I get lovely gifts around these ways, don't I? Did you see CLA has printed off a scarf with my imagery on? She's drawn me and she's put EQ on the scarf. So she's trying to sell merch in my name. I shan't have it. Yeah, have a look at my story on the on on this account, and you'll see. I circled her. She's drawn me on on a, on a piece of piece of piece of paper or whatever she's done in the loony bin, most probably. And now she's printed it onto um, highly flammable. Thank you so much, Jay Callan. Thank you, racing girl. Make sure to comment. Hello, Nathan. Make sure to comment uh, so you can get pinned. Love so we get everyone to follow you. 
<clears throat> Do you know what I mean? So, she, and she's imagining me with not on, not on. Thank you, Mrs. Big Balls. Thank you so much. Make sure to comment to be pin you for 60 seconds. Everyone, make sure to follow everyone who's pinned. Thank you, Sharmi. I'm Sharmi. Can't say your name for Taffy. So, yeah, she's uh, she's thinking of me in the all togethers. You know what I mean? In my birthday suit. Thank you so much, Shell Bell. She's she's writing my name on these scarves, so I'll be expecting some um, commission off these off these um, these rags. But they'll have to be better quality. Thank you so much. They're totally see through. Thank you, Master. Honestly, see right through them. They must be printed on the most thinnest piece of fabric I've ever come across in my life. I can see the whole house when she holds it up. I can see right through them. So that's terrible quality. You can't see through silk, can you, love? Thank you, Charmaine. You can't see through silk, can you, everybody? Hold a piece of silk up to the light. You won't be able to see through it. Because that's quality, you see. Chelsea Liard is trying to create... Imagine, it would only take one light, one light of a cigarette or you'd be up in flames. You wouldn't have a hair left on your head. So, honestly, it's just crazy. That you've got, it won't... So, any, any, anyone's like that, that's all ever with my, my image on. Thank you so much, LW. Thank you, beautiful. Then I want a commission. You've got permission to use it, obviously. Um, But if, if you sell any, I want some money. It'll be a new number for long. You'll have to get another one by tomorrow. I can assure oh. you that much. Good night. Um. <laughs> Did you just say that? <laughs> Are you a savage? Ems went there. Oh my god. She ate and left no crumbs with the delusive one. Lady, how are you, Miguel? With the internet, guys, Ems, is, uh, their phone number is going to be in my Discord. So if you want to join my Discord, do request me. And you'll have got some information there. Lady, how are you, Miguel? With the internet, giving... guys, Ems, is, uh, their phone number is going to be. Why are they all giving each other's phone numbers out? Thank you much, so much, sincerely, sincerely, Mace. What are they all doing? Oh my god. Like anyone gives us stuff. Mother Teresa's last supper as a live streamer. Like anyone cares. Apparently they've left the app. Does anyone care? No. Em's being nasty about Angie's dad. Not even worthy to be played. I'd understand if, if, you know, Ems was leaving or CLA was leaving or someone of big proportion. But somebody who doesn't even put the face of the camera with barely any views. You know, looks like they spend half the day on, on the pipe. We could never be interested in. Good riddance. Don't let the door hit you where the good lord split you. Is all I have to say about it. Thank you so much, Steve Backup, for the future encounter. Thank you so much, babes. Make sure to pin anyone who sends me a lovely gift for 60 seconds. And if you're not already following me, I scamp this where I am for the week now. You know what I mean? Because I was, I was very naughty, I was. So Em's being nasty about Angie's dad. So look at the little broccolis on the wall behind her. She's very creative as our Em's, isn't she? You know what I mean? You don't, like, steam it. Well... You never know, you might choke on it. Don't, um... This is the honest FYP around these ways. I say what everybody else is thinking. Marcus Ems with some facts about friendships on the app. You're not friends. People on this app, you are not... She's been sucking the helium balloons. Why is she talking like that? You're not friends. People on this app. You are not friends with people on this app. I can assure you that now. But you can be friends with people, Ems. Hello, Haley. Come up, my lovely girl. We love Haley about time. Make sure to pin Haley and everyone follow Haley, love. Yes. Uh, she's a fact finder, she is. And she does all that true crime stuff, so if you're interested in all that. And she was spearheading the Jay Slater campaign, remember? So, yeah, make sure to follow her. She's there in the comments. Um, Ems, you have got friends on the app. You've got to hang around with successful people, though. People who can match you, who are like on a viewership, and you know, the likes of me, you know, me with no gain to had. Thank you so much, Haley. I love you too. Yes, turn up for the books, everyone. We love Haley. Um, so yeah, so I, I think she can have friends, but you've got to have friends on your on your level. The likes of Corey and John, 
bloody shield. Thank you, Jessica. They're lower than lower than the bottom feeder. So they're always going to be clouting off you, and they're not, you're not going to get true friendship because they want to gain something from you. You know what I mean? When do you see me joining Ems's box? I've got Ems's number. You know what I mean? If she needs me help on anything, she messages me. And um, my mate was laughing yesterday because they all message me. You see, what you don't realise is everyone is that the creators who've got my number all message me. You know what I mean? Like for advice on and something and that. So I'm like a I'm like a TikTok agony aunt in a way because as I give them good advice, my phone often pings with with like some question or you know what I mean. So yeah, so I like and I help them. <laughs> Everyone does everything for fucking clout. They all talk to each other, argue with each other. It's lit. I don't talk to anyone apart from people who I make genuine friendships with off the app as well. So we purely the clouds. Yeah, the people you're hanging around with are doing that, but you're allowing them in your box every night, you know what I mean? You don't need, you don't need cheerleaders in your box. To keep people entertained, you know what I mean? Acquaintances, yeah. No one's friends with each other on this app. Oh, well, I'm friends with you. Right. Alpha Besides. Subscriber toothbrush. It's got bristles on it. Alpha Besides. He can't brush his teeth due to getting abscesses in his mouth, and because he can't be asked with it, slash it's too much of an effort. This one is posting about wanting to find love and this, that, and the other. Nobody wants to kiss a smelly mouth, so you have to brush your teeth. Because it'll be, you know, putrid inside there, so no one's gonna wanna, like, kiss, you know what I mean, someone who doesn't brush the teeth, because if you don't brush your teeth, then you're gonna get, like, um, cottage cheese around your gum line, aren't you, you know what I mean, and your teeth are gonna feel all, like, gritty and sandpapery, and your tongue, you've got to give your tongue a good old brush, you know what I mean, dirtiest thing in your mouth, your tongue. So, honestly, I pity anybody who uh, ever has the misfortune of um, standing within breathing distance. Describe a toothbrush. It's got bristles on it. It works sometimes with electric. You charge it up sometimes. And then you put the toothpaste on, put water under it, and you brush. But you want to know, I struggle brushing my teeth sometimes because... Why is he aged all of a sudden? Like, he's he looks like he's... A 48 year old businessman, you know what I mean? Like, age is not hitting well on Alphabet. Have you not noticed? Like, he looks so old. Like, this is a 19 year old, is it? 19? It's 19 and or 20. 20? You know what I mean? It's like something off Band of Gold. It's gonna start walking down the streets looking for punters. Because I have really bad mental health issues. Twenty years of age. Actually causes me to have abscesses in my mouth. Yeah, I that openly, and I like everyone says you want to assume that, be like, oh, oh, I clean my teeth. It's not really easy all the time because it's sometimes very hard for a few people. One, the taste. Two, the toothpaste. Two, the the time and just the effort to put into it. I can't be asked sometimes. He's got nice hair. Oh my god, I've seen horses with better cat manes than that thing. So yeah, I will say sometimes I'm, I, I'm actually unhygienic. I'm very f admit that. I don't go f on things. Life's too f to live. Oh my god. Not me. Do you know what? Alphabet has one of the foulest mouths you'd ever come across in, in life. Everything's F. This, F, that, F, the other. It's every other sentence. Every other, every other syllable. Thank you, Manic Menopause. Do you know what I mean? At least I can say that out loud when people hide it. When they're unhygienic. Charming. Not many people can just say that out of the blue, can they? I don't Ah, oh, the mouth. Angie just sat there and basically told people to go and report me. That's why I've changed accounts onto this one now. Ma I was on my backup. Mass reporting doesn't work. Thank you so much, Daria. Thank you, babes. Thank you. Yvonne. Mass reporting does not work. You have to be violating the rules in order for anything to to stick, you know what I mean? You just get a load of people getting this live does not not like go against community guidelines. How many people reported Elphaba's live that night before it got reported and taken down, you know what I mean? And a lot of people got there's no problem with this live, you know, we've seen a lot of creators doing things and 
the live sync goes down and there's hundreds of people reporting those. So it doesn't work, it's just um, old wives' tales. But it's not my backup, it's like actually the main. This one's more my backup. I know it's weird. But Angie's just sat there on a live stream whilst I'm here, minding my own business. Well, <laughs> I have to say, um, she's a liar. She never minds her own business, she's always doing something. And she's told people. Um, imagine Ems just said she minds her own business. Liar. People to go and report me because apparently I'm doxing her address. I want to play like that and if you want to sit there and... Oh God. Like I said before, and I will say again, nobody on this app is a fucking friend. Liar. Every single Thank person you, on this app that does live streams are out for themselves. Nobody is friends. Not. She said when she said yeah, everyone's out for themselves. I took a look at how many diamonds I've made. <laughs> if you noticed that I just looked up, I was looking checking how many diamonds I've made. She brought it to me, man. You say? Fucking true friends, anyway. All is good. You all want the count, and I understand that. And it's like when people sit there and moan at me. So I need an M's top. I just want an M's top. Saying, you know, oh, people only come to your kitchen for clout. All right, yeah, people come to my kitchen for clout. But they're I've got an open invite to the kitchen, love, so I could go whenever I wanted. Um, me and M's have got plans. Um, when the TikTok Big Brother house starts, you know, I'll say no more. But we're going to steal all the viewers. And you'll see me inside the kitchen, the freshly decorated kitchen, probably by then. Don't I get caught from it as well? Yes, I Yeah, I love Ems. Ems is great. I do. Every single, even me. When we first come on the app, we locked horns because obviously it was a fight for the viewers back then, but everyone's got their own viewers now, you know what I mean? I don't feel like I'm in competition with anyone, to be honest. I don't feel like I have any competition. You know, so I don't enter into the whole power struggle of views and stuff and that's why I can say that I like people and actually like them, you know what I mean, without any gain. I suppose I do gain, though, off every creator that I do play because I'm getting gifted while their images on the screen, so, but... Well, maybe, maybe I am a scammer. Out there for themselves and me to do well on your own platform. Like when AR came here, I had fucking 8k people in my life. What size are you in a top? I'll make you an evil queen one. And if you're in a Jackson medium. Thank you so much, Lisa. Thank you, my darling. Make sure to pin Lisa for 60 seconds. I say that because I, 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 I iron his clothes, so I see, the, I see the tags. Well, the last one I ironed was definitely a medium. And I am... Um, I'm, I'm, I think I'm a size 12, to be honest, so, like, a large. <laughs> oh, God. They're all medium, I thought, so. Say, look at that. I know all about jack sizes. Stream. When I fell from the bus stop, didn't realise how, how big that, that would have got. A 30k. Yes, I am a, I'm a size 12. And uh, when I order anything now, if it's a tracksuit or whatever, I'll get a medium. And in Big House, I'm now in a large... You no, know, it goes in size of that. So I have to get like a 12 in that. So. But one of them um, is a medium and it, and it doesn't fit me very well anymore. Yeah, medium size. But it's all good because I've got the best... Um, bum, bum going, love. and you know why my bum's so good is because all my life I was skinny. I could never put weight on, you know what I mean? I, I could eat anything I wanted and just not put weight on. And then as I got a bit older, obviously, I had like um, this weird... Um, I think it, it was like... So when anything had happened, I wouldn't eat, you know what I mean? Like, I'd kind of like, I don't know, I must have had some eating disorder or something, like, and, I, and I'd punish myself by... Being that the only thing that I could be in control of was what I ate, you know what I mean, and stuff. So, like, if anything ever happened, like, I wouldn't eat. I just wouldn't eat, you know what I mean? I'd just, like, whatever. When I was feeling, like, obviously down in the dumps and all that, like, over the past few years or what have you. So, uh, so I think I had, like, a, a food issue. Um, so, 
when everything else was out of control, I could control, like, me intake of what I had. If I didn't feel like... If I felt like shit, I'd be like, well, I'm not I'm not going to eat, you know what I mean? So I ended up losing loads of weight, and I was like um, seven stone something. It was really, hot, really terrible. I, and I've always been skinny, so I've never put weight on. So now that I've put weight on, I think I don't have a saggy bum or anything. It's proper, like, full and juicy. Um, and that's because it's never been stretched before. You know, like, over your lifetime, women put weight on and lose weight and put weight on. So, the elasticity of the skin. But mine's never been elasticated. So, it's like I've got a 20-year-old's bum. It's amazing, honestly. Ask me boyfriend. He's in the chat. He'll tell you all about it. It people in the fucking John <laughs> shit. And he's 27, you know what I mean? And I'm 37, but I look 34 now with me new hair done. Fields at about 4k. But anyway, moral of, the, moral of the story, I'm happy in life now. And I never, never use food as a, as anything. I just eat. I enjoy food. And yes, I feel much better in life. And um, I don't have any, any sad days really now, you know what I mean? So yes, if you are currently feeling sad, well, take me as an example of... I'm now 11 stone. A size 12, and yes, I've got a lovely boyfriend, so it, it all comes back around, do you know what I mean, everything happens for a reason, thank you so much Nanny Pepper, thank you, everything happens for a reason, thank you so much Zach, choo choo, hello Zach, so um, the bad things happen to make way for the good stuff, you know what I mean, so you get the bad stuff out of the way and all that, and then the good stuff starts happening. Jack treats you amazing, he does, he's so lovely, honestly. Sean Saunders. Well, I've lost track of what was going on in this clip now. Thank you so much, everyone. Helpful is absolutely gagged and comes live with a message for Wicked and Adina. So I don't know if anyone's seen the screenshot today. Whoever tags Adina Mendez, who sings that bloody Defying Gravity song or whatever, um, she looks at the story because obviously she's not going to get mass amounts of she's not really like i know she's like a musical legend or whatever but like she's not like current really and people are not really at her in the stories you know what i mean so she's got more chance of seeing the notifications in 2024 so somebody else tagged her in the story and she's seen the story but so elphaba was getting gagged about sadina menez whatever her name is mendez i can't remember what her name is um, looking at a story as if like she was supporting her in some way, but it wasn't. She looks at anything, obviously, because she must not get that many tags in stories. Adina Menzel. Oh, she sung Let It Go. There we go. See, I don't even know you, say. She watched my video. Because you tagged her in it. And she's not, obviously, popular on social media much, unless she's uploading her own content, so she wouldn't get many notifications and just happened to see it. And then they seen someone else who tagged her. Everyone go and tag that person in, in an Instagram story and I bet you they see her. And then I get Wicked in Brazil. Kerry Katona looks at my story all the time. Love you don't hear me shouting about it, do you? You know what I mean? <clears throat> I've got uh, Frankie Grande. He follows me on over on Twitter. X. You know, that's Ariana Grande's brother. You don't hear me going on about it, do you, love? Loads of celebrities follow me. These people don't even follow you. Loving my singing. What's happening? The productions all over the world of Wicked are loving me. I don't know what's happening. Adina Menzel viewed my story. I, I, I don't know what to say. I, I really don't know. When you're idle, when you're idle, quite literally looks at your story, you don't know how to react. I don't actually understand. I don't think any of you understand how much of an idol she is to me. Like, oh, Adina Menzel is God. like... The, the mother of musical theatre for me. Like, I can. If Adina's ever watching this, I love you so much. You're, you've literally inspired me to come out as trans. You got me through some really tough stuff in my life. Thank you so much for what you do. And you're just amazing. And we all love you. My chat loves you. We all love you. And, and that's it, really. And a message to Wicked you're the best musical in the entire world. You've saved me from the, from the worst. When I listened to your soundtrack, it got me through the worst, worst times of my life. It helped me come out as trans, it helped me be who I am today. It's also inspired me and changed my life in the sense of making friends. It's given me a platform 
Wicked's given me a platform on top of that and I am forever grateful for that. And I just want to say I love you so much to all the supporters out there that love me and support Wow, crack a shit. <laughs> what an absolute mumbo jumbo filled speech full of nothingness. So somebody's seen your story because you tagged them in it. Big effing deal. Stop the national newspapers. Support me. Your support does not go on there as whatsoever. She's not supported, yeah? What are you talking about? She looked at your story. Because you tagged her. Honest to God, delusional. And you are incredible. So God bless you all. I love you with all my heart. Because I can only put out love to Liar. you. Liar! God bless you all, oh my god, you're gonna burn in the fires. Your chat is sending me. How in the world <clears> going there? down. The way the world's going, stop spreading hate, baby. Do you know what I mean? Stop yeah. spreading disease then. The latest episodes of Pink Eye, you know what I mean? I wonder how many people are gonna contage that from you, you know what I mean? Just contract. How, they, how many people are gonna contract Pink Eye? You know what I mean? Fist, scabies, Pink Eye, you know what I mean? This, that, and the other. Thank you so much, Rebecca and Louise. Thank you, babe. Happiness, you know what I mean? Nips, bed bugs. Love yourself. <clears throat> be yourself. And have a spa. Hi, lunatic. Thank you so much, Hannah. Thank God it's never going to reproduce. Be a bad bitch. Thank you so much, J.K. Allen. Now, full mate. Imagine advising people to go and get a spa, the great unwashed. Honestly, this app, how is it a free app? Thank you so much, Laura. Honestly, I get that many shits and giggles every single day about some of the shit that these people come out with. Well, my app is smart. The smartest on the app? Is that what's coming? No, I am fucking smart because I'm the most fucking smart bitch on this app and I know how to get views like that. But you don't know how to get money, do you? And money makes the world go around. I know how to do it. Look at my fucking accounts. Views don't pay the bills, you know what I mean? Well, they do if you post uh, videos, you know what I mean, but... 4 million views, 1.2 million views, 1.7 million views. I know how to market myself. Babe. The world changes so quick, doesn't it? Now views actually do pay the bills. So you have to scratch that one. You don't. But you don't get any views. It's hardly like you've got 75,000 people in like Gypsy Rose Blanchard, is it? And that's why people get so annoyed at me, because I know how to market myself. I know how to get views. It's so easy. I know how to market myself, yeah, in the worst possible way. And it's takes a lot. Worst marketing genius I've ever come across in my life. But dedication. I erupt smarter into the toilet. Twice daily, sometimes. You know what I mean? Like, honestly, that is some smart shit that goes down that toilet because it comes from inside of me. So, that shit that's in, that comes out of me has been inside, so it knows, like, and my brain is so switched on. Da -da -da. So, honestly, I have dumps that I'm more intelligent than this person. A lot of time, a lot Thank of Thank you so much, Hayley. Thank you, babe. You don't realize. You know what I mean? Being a creator, being a TikTok person isn't all that great. It comes with a lot of shit, right? You know what I mean? And if you are enjoying me, little show, love, make sure to um, do your daily heart, me, and subscribe. Subscribe on this account. Thank you, JP. Thanks so much. JP, I swear to God, you sound identical to John Shields. You've got the. If you dyed your hair blue and drawed your nose red, I would swear it was John Shields talking. You're identical, identical? Couldn't believe it. <laughs> Thank you, Louise, for subscribing. Yeah. Rude, come on. Oh, come on then, Helly. Oh, come LJ, thank you so much for the giraffe. Thank you, beautiful. I love you lots. Thank you, LJ. Come on then. Let's fucking go. Helly, 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 Helly. Thank you so much, Grace. Well, my ass is smart. Like, kind of had it seen, they don't know what it could be. Who the hell? TikTok Drama UK3, why have you turned the sound so loud? Thank you so much, Grace. Maybe your phone's broken because this, honestly, you could hear it in space if I actually press play. Thank you so much, Jillian.
and I think it's either a bloodshot eye or conjunctivitis. It'll definitely be conjunctivitis related because it's not going to be just a bloodshot eye. It's on your body. Okay. Thank you so much, Nana Bear. Thank you. Help of us looking cleaner these days. You need to give him spectacles that are uh, clean, love, or, you know what I mean, go and increase the strength a little bit because he's just been saying he never brushes his teeth. So, are you mad? Um, because I say I've got no pus coming out of it. It's not infected. It's just red. And it's not causing any sort of pain, really. Kate, thank you so much for the galaxy. Thank you, Kate. I love you, all of the galaxy, Kate. Thank you so much. And thank you, LJ. We are friends. I mean, when I close my eye, thank you, Louise. It, it causes like a little bit of discomfort, but not pain. Thank and you, my eyes are glued shut in the morning. It's not gooey, it's literally normal. So I think I'm, I might have hit it on something. <laughs> but I'm I can only ever remember one time, and um, we were visiting my auntie who lived in York. Um, so we were staying in my auntie's, and I woke up. Thank you so much, Billy, Mrs. Big Balls. I woke up in the morning time, and I couldn't open my eyes. They were all crusted shirts, but it was like not pussy or anything. It was like dry crusts, and like, my eyes, I was like, I felt like super glued together. I did not panic. So obviously that sticks with you, doesn't it? Because it's like a traumatic thing. Because as a kid, you'd find that traumatizing, wouldn't you? Not being able to open your eyes. Thank you so much, Equipoor. Choo choo. So I've only ever had that once. When I was a kid. Thank you, LJ, for the diamond tree. Thank you so much, LJ. I have followed you. Thank you, Equipoor, as well. Thank you, babes. I've got eye drops. So. Your life is not eligible for recommendation and is restricted. Your life does not comply with the For You eligibility standards. Reproduced or... Oh, I'll have to restart, loves. Thank you, Equipoor. Thank you, Jenny. Follow me if you're not already because I'm restarting. It takes 30 seconds for me to be back. Just refresh the page. Follow me quickly, otherwise you'll lose me. And um, we've got loads of alphabet today as well, talking about me and everything else that's been going on, so you don't want to miss it, do you? So I'll be back momentarily. I've got all the clips to play. Normally, Alphabet is triggered even though he says he won't react anymore. But at least spell it right, cost dresser. Guys, apparently I'm a cost dresser. Cross dresser. As well. A cost dresser. It's C R O S S D R E S S E A. E R. I got it E R! The man went mad in front of our eyes. Rawr! Oh, I'm a cost dresser. It costs a lot. Thank you for the compliments on my hair. I love my hair. <laughs> it's very lovely. Oh, oh someone said sleep. <laughs> Girl, I'm set up for. Girl, you cannot affect me. Like, saying shit like that, yeah. <laughs> I just look at it a lot. Lewis, let's look at you, babe. Right, you're telling me to slip, right? Babe, you can't even show your fucking face on a profile pic for starters. You've got an anime fucking profile pic thinking you're. Oh, the F words constantly. Something, a little death note fan or something. It's not a fucking meme. You're probably sat on your fucking computer being a fucking nerd. <laughs> Tonight is something. You know what I mean? Telling me to slip my wrist. Come on. I'll just keep my finger on it. <laughs> Girl, I've been told it so many times. I'm used to it. And yes, the eyebrow was raised. Am I going out? Maybe. Why has he got such a bad attitude? It is right. Yes. It's a racist, racist, racist. Hell is 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 a racist, racist, racist. Oh, our great song. Hell is a racist, racist, racist. Hell is a racist place. <laughs> yeah, I love that. 
Ja, yeah, it's gone crazy. Notes, notes everywhere. Thank you so much, Miss Buddy. The app's gone mad. Oh my god! Sanity! Insanity! How about Santa Don't? It's awful. Turn it off. Santa Hey, it's not true. Santa do my foot. Alicia Flores argues with Brett about the JC carry on. He's like, what the words he's saying is not what I said at all. <laughs> so you never. I told, told him what happened, oh, no. and I've, I phoned JC. I was on live, and JC phoned me, and I answered. And I, at the end of the day, I have the recording. I'm not gonna. I'm not about to put that record. I could easily clear my name, and everyone will stop calling me a liar. I could play that recording on live, but I'm not gonna do that because I don't. I'm not about what you, like you. I've got the clip of JC, which he's uploaded. Thank you, LJ, for the try. You can travel anytime with me, LJ. Thank you so much. It's not the full call. She goes butt and he cuts it off. So there's more to that recording. So that's no um, proof of innocence. I'm not easily fooled. And the end has been cut off. I, I, I'll play it now, actually, now that we're talking about it. So, JC has uploaded a video of a recorded conversation between him and Alicia yesterday, which occurred yesterday. But if you listen at the end, he cut he cuts the recording off where she says but, and he obviously he hasn't caught it in time. Thank you so much, Beck, so we can hear it. Mm. Jane Duffy, thank you so much. Choo -choo. Thank you, Jane. Make sure to comment in the chat and we'll get you pinned. Because people think that you've basically <laughs> been led there in bed, like near enough crying, yeah. saying no, 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 whilst yeah, I've been forcing myself onto you. Yeah. And, and I didn't do that. that. Do you know what I mean? I didn't do that. Yeah. I've never said that. But when you've come on live and said no, 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 like everyone's going to think that. Everyone's going to be like, oh, well, he obviously has done that then. If she said that, he said no, no, no. Like end of the day i can't tell you what you can and can say on that because they'll try and use that against me to like look you need to you've you've told her you've manipulated her you've threatened her you paid her off like i've not done any of that to you i've not like yeah. said you have to go on live and say this or come in my fucking live and gift me and shit like that. i've not done anything like that i've literally kept myself off tiktok to try and basically fucking leave it at that and then obviously when yeah. you come in a box and clear my name and said like nothing like that happens yeah. to you like i'm having to like I'm having to speak to you off the phone. To but this is the thing that like, I've I've literally like people need to drop it. I've come on live. I've said it didn't because I don't want anything. Like I don't think nothing should be on live of the sort. Like of this, nothing should be on live. So that's why I came in and said that, and that's why I was so quick. And every, everyone was like, "Oh, she's being suspicious. She's definitely lying about everything, um, and all this." And do you know what I mean? I don't. But the, the way that people, they... are, people are making out like I've literally been calling you a predator. Like that's not the case. It was that one. Someone just said it was. It's so pathetic gossiping about I'm gossiping, I'm gossiping about people's lives. Oh, I love that. Yeah, we love to gossip about everyone's lives. Phone call with Birdman, and I've not spoken about it since. Mm. But because me and you both, how are you lot against JC? Because we can see what's actually going on. He's manipulating the situation. He's only bothered about the terminology grape, and she said that that was not the word that she used. So he's using this call as like a well, everyone thinks that a grape jet, and that's all he's focusing on. But he's not focusing on what actually happened because listen to the recording now. Both know when we had sex, it was consensual. Like I didn't fucking force myself on you. You weren't saying no when we was having sex. Do you know what I mean? Like, See, they keep saying when we was having that. So there's another part to it. Something else happened. Do you know what I mean? But when we were actually having, you know what? That was consensual. I didn't grape you. You know what I mean? So that's what he's saying. But he's missing out a part. Yeah, and I'm not. I said that's that, that's what I mean. There's the sex was consensual. See, but she says at the end, listen. The sex was consensual, but, mm. but she and he cut it off. So there's something else. Yet the S part might be consensual, but like I pointed out, he might have woken up in the night and thought he could have another go. Do you know 
just because he'd had permission once, you know what I mean? So, there's more to this. And uh, I don't, we, us smart people on this live don't accept that as any type of evidence at all. Because you've cut the recording. You've cut the recording. She says but at the end of it, so there's more to it. Saying is not true. He's like what the words he's saying is not what I said at all. So you never. I told him what happened, and I I phoned JC. I was on live, and JC phoned me, and I answered. And I, at the end of the day, I have the recording. I'm not gonna. I'm not about to put that record. I could easily clear my name. She might just be better putting the record up though, because he's put half a version up, and if she's got the full version, then she can show that he's manipulating people, you know what I mean, by what he's put up on his own profile. So she could actually prove him to be what he is, what she says he is, very easily, because he'll look like the biggest manipulative liar ever if she puts a longer version out, you know what I mean, and says this is where he's ended it, where she talks about that part was consensual, but... And then he cut the recording. My name and everyone will stop calling me a liar. I could play that recording on live, but I'm not going to do that because I don't, I'm not about what you like. You like to create drama. Like you create drama that's fake. No, this is I real stuff going on right now. You are doing fake stuff on this app. I'm, this is real stuff going on right now. There's a lot if of I don't want to go to the police and I don't want anything to come of it, that's my decision. No one else is. If you've not been in that position before, then you have no right okay, but to have a word on it. You should have gone to the police yourself. Why should have I? In, if I don't want to go to the police about it, I don't have to go to the police. Yes. And I told Birdman this, at the, the day after this happened, I phoned Birdman and I told him I don't want to go to the police about it. What's frustrating is, like, hero moderators are muting people who are actually, like, saying we believe you, blah, blah, blah. I was in a live last night and I was saying, like, um, surely you should actually tell people what's happened in case it happens to somebody else. And I got muted. And I was saying, oh, yeah, like, we believe you, I believe you. So, it wasn't here, it was a moderator. I've got the screen recording. And it, I'll tell you the person's name who, who muted me. Because I was recording the screen. Because obviously, she, when she first came on, she had like 300 people. So I was thinking there might not be a screen recorder in. I'll tell you the name of the account that, that blocked me. That muted me, sorry, not blocked me. There we go. Sorry, I'm just scrolling through. Thank you so much, Sean, because it pops up which moderator does it, you know what I mean? I said a dangerous man needs to be addressed and then I got muted at this point so let me tell you what it comes down and popped down and said Sorry you have to give me a sec I've said it now so I'm determined to tell you the name of the person I wrote he could do this to someone else. Was this my last comment that I was able to make? You were muted by moderator Tony Egan. Tony Egan with an ice cream next to his name. So a man. A man muted me. For saying like, well, you do really need to raise awareness. So it was Tony Egan. Muted me and I was supporting her. I've su I'm still supporting her now. It doesn't bother me, like, because it, it's a moderator, not her. She didn't mute me or anything, you know what I mean? So it was a moderator. So I get the suspicion that a support, a support is getting taken out by this Tony Egan. So he must like JC for some reason, you know what I mean? That is normal. Like, unfortunately, there's no evidence of anything. She said she'd mute anyone who talks about it in the chat. She was literally talking about it, though. She was literally talking about it. 
So, if she's talking about it, then she's going against what she said. So, people are going to comment on what she's talking about. Hmm. Trans, oh no, love, I'm not trans. Never been trans, thank you very much. There was no... I got struck in the throat with a hammer as a child. And it affected me vocal cords. Thank you so much, Sean. Evidence. What's the evidence? My word against his. No. Um, I'm not going to the police about anything. And it's not... I've got... Please, someone tell me what happened. So, JC Golf um, essayed this girl on the screen. Um, they had consensual you-know-what. And then he's rolled over in the night and put it in again. And obviously, that's where this become an issue then because she was asleep. Like, I don't want to affect my mental health. I'm not going to the police about anything. Okay, okay so why did you tell Birdman then? What, okay, I told what, Birdman what, what happened. What did you tell Birdman? What did you tell Birdman? I'm not putting that on your, pl your platform. I, 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 I'm not about to sit here and put that on your platform. All I'm saying is you need to stop talking about it. I have because what because because you I have not. So you ha JC is focusing on the fact of the well the air, the S was consensual. That part of it was, but anything after or that came after, she wasn't willing for, and that's the problem here. So he's trying to fool everyone, going, "Well, well, we had consensual S. That doesn't mean he can't SA her later on in the evening. You know what I mean? Because he's had his wicked way once, thinking he can do it again, take advantage. You know what I mean? And when she's been not up for it, then that's where the issues come from. So he's focusing on the one occasion that they had it consensually. So if you had consensual S with, S with somebody once, that means they can do it any time they want to. Yeah. That means they can do it any time they want to, because you did it once, so you've already, you, you, well, you consented, and you know what I mean? So that's what, that's what some idiots are trying to um, insinuate, though, that because the, the, that part was consensual, that nothing could have occurred afterwards. You have, have no talent, you have nothing to go off of your, like, have you have to, nothing to go off I, of your channel, why would I you sit to there and you? say, oh, I know Alicia very well, we've why, met once, why would we've I met I once in you? life, and you're like, oh, I've met Alicia in real life, and I know her very well, and I know for a fact she's lying, you, you've met me once in real life, Where, and I stuck up for you, I stuck up Alicia, for you that I once when no one else you. would, and Guys, she requested me. Remember that she requested me. Not getting any, he's, nothing's you going his way, me. so he wants to leave. The Brett, whenever me. Brett loses a battle, you. he leaves. Brett's you, boring. You, Brett has nothing me. to his you name. You requested me. So if I'm boring, why did you request me? Because you're chatting shit on my name all yeah, over I the app. So much shit on your name. You have. Right you have. Yeah. Oh my god! Why does she need the microphone? She's a singer. So she sings usually. But the drama's come to her with this situation, so that's her tool of the trade. So that's where she normally sings and speaks into, you know what I mean? So it's because cause she's a singer. Are you happy now? Yeah, I, I say that you're troubled. You are Everyone troubled. Everyone banging on about the microphone. What about the essay? No one cares about the microphone. We care about a woman. It was being essayed. And all you're focusing on is the damn microphone. Because what? Troubled. Because I've said because I've said the troubled. truth. You're troubled. But you're troubled. I don't I bring mean, anything to the app. You're the one that told me you, that you, you create you fake drama. There. You literally, you, you message all there. these people off of the you app. You told there. me this in person. No. You message all these people off the app and what? you create this Prove drama it. version Prove so you can get Prove views it. and gifts. Prove you told me one, this in person. Exactly. If there's no proof, then nothing's going to come. If there's no proof, then you're a liar. That's Lisa, the facts. No one cares about your fake drama. No one cares about you, Brett. You're no boring. one's ever cared about you either. You being You're boring. Like no much. one cares about you. No one cares about you. No, what I was thinking today is that like these men are passing this girl around, do you know what I mean? One of them went with her, then another one's went with her. It wouldn't surprise me if DC Dexter's been with her too, you know what I mean? Like they share women like, oh she's easy, like she let me do it with her, like first time I met her. And they and they're getting pa these women are getting passed around, these men, you know what I mean? That's what I believe is happening. I respect that with that person before, it's kinda of like at least you say she goes to the police, oh, but court cases take too long. Guilty, JC's even though it was nothing to do with me. It was after, but I'm like, oh. And I, oh. I respect that you came to me with, like, every... Like, you was like, this is what yeah. I mean. And I respect that you came to me. She's letting men, yeah, but they've got big platforms, haven't they? And are winning leaderboards and this, that and the other. So, like, 
she's being like clout is a very powerful thing it can drop people's knickers and undies you know what i mean like it, it, i'm sorry to say it can you know what i mean like um a lot of people and i've come across them in my time as you know you know what i mean they'll drop their undies for a bit of clout for some extra followers and all that you know what i mean so these fellas use their platforms as a tool like to entice women also almost grooming them into well you know like i can she's a singer as well you know what i mean oh i'll be able to get your music out there and all that yeah if you come on my platform blah 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 and before you know it the beds in her using her abusing her nailing her and bailing her and she's left feeling useless and she's only 20 years of age these men who've been with a beard man is in his 30s you know what i mean these um the jc is in his 30s this girl's 20. Yeah, and I'm receiving reports in from an anonymous source saying JC's got a history of sending um, inappropriate pictures to his mods and doing the deed with multiple of them. Yeah, DG wouldn't have any female interest if he wasn't a creator. Exactly. You know what I mean? Who in the right mind would go near the bean sprout if he didn't have clout or some cash in the bank? You know what I mean? How do you think he pulled that LK, you know what I mean? Clout. ...to me about it, and do you know what, do you know what, karma comes back around, and that's what I've always said, karma always, the truth comes out. I do think that the passing girls around, I really do, I think they're saying, hey, I've been with this one, look at her, she's decent here, isn't she, blah, 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 and these fellas don't want relationships because some men just think with the, the tackle, don't they? And that's all some people are interested in, you know what I mean? Like, uh, like gratifying themselves in that way. Um, and I think that's what's happening. They're passing names to each other of who's letting them bed who and this, that and the other. And karma comes out. Yeah, that's um, true. So she's 20 and she's bedded bed man who's in her 30s and JC who's in her 30s. These are like, you know what I mean? And then she's not in relationships with any of them, so. And women are a lot more like, you know, like expect if you know what I mean of some type of follow up relationship maybe or dates or whatever but these men have got one thing in mind near these women and then are leaving them damaged do you know what I mean and it's gone too far I think with JC I think he's pushed his luck a little bit too far and now it's backfired that the is truth true. always comes out and the truth came out then the truth remember she's only 20 she's an immature man she's still she's still just coming coming out of being um a young adult a teenager you know what i mean she's only 20 oh well somebody said she was 20 now people are saying she's 26 but uh, nevertheless you know what i mean 26 year old minds are not like as clued up as people in the 30s in my opinion it's going to come out now with the situation that's going on with me right now and calm is going to come yeah she's 26 see what i mean these two young 20 year olds whether she be 20 whether she be 26 she's a musician obviously she's got an overinflated ego when it comes to the singing because i've heard her sing and i can hear that this type of musical variety across 20 different other live streamers just in the uk alone so she hasn't got any special talent, you know what I mean? She can't belt them out there, she's no Adele or anything. So she's obviously a struggling musician, because all musicians are always, like, struggling, aren't they? Because they need that big break, and she believes she's more talented than what she is. She's tried to social climb with these men, you know, because she's known that there's something in the fray, clout or whatever. So, you know, I'm not saying she's, like, innocent in... That she didn't know that she'd maybe get some clout or this, that and the other. But I think she's pushed the luck a little bit too far with these older men. And one of them has uh, gone that one step further with her and now she doesn't like it, you know what I mean? So, which she shouldn't like it, obviously. But, like, you know, now there's an issue. But I believe that she is baiting the audience a lot too, which is annoying to see. Like, she's like, something happened. But don't say something happened and then not tell people what happened because everyone's going to want to know for their own safety. Some people follow him. Some people have got young children who follow him. He's got a young daughter himself and you're flaring everybody up, making out like he's this big essayer and he's assaulted you in some way. And you could go to the police if you wanted to. And he's apologised and said thank you. And we can hear on that voice message that JC's put up. She goes, um, the S was consensual, but... And he cut it off at the butt. So something's definitely happened, but she is not helping the situation one little bit. You know what I mean? She She's not helping the situation.
Um, yeah. I'm more passionate about it than the person who's it's happened to, you know what I mean? People are believing what they want to hear right now. The, 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 thing is the, day, TikTok, the thing is with TikTok, Alicia, I could say it now to everybody. So I guys, believe her 100%, I, but I believe she's warped in the mind a bit because she's playing it out like it, you know what I mean? Like it's giving little tidbits every day, a new little bit every day, you know what I mean? And now he's put that recording out, and you can thank you, JP. Thank you so much. And now uh, we can hear a butt at the end. So now he's left some of the out. I believe he's guilty because you would have put the whole recording up. If you had, if, even if she said, oh, yeah, but this, that, and the other, why hasn't he put it up? Outside, and all the grass in the park is now blue. It's no longer green. Yeah. And people will believe me, and then they'll go start telling their friends. And before it you depends, know it... It depends on your, like, do you know what I mean? If, if you're... What people are not understanding, like, people are coming for me, like, why are you not, like, now it's all out on TikTok, why are you still defending this person? At the end of the day, this person has a lot of power on this app. If you're going, like, do you know what I mean? If someone has a lot of power on this app, what do you do with that? And I have a lot of power on this app and campaigning for you, uh, you know, so as much as he thinks he's got a big platform, mine is bigger, my dear. So you've got somebody literally who's got your back. You know what I mean? And we'll put the correct information out there and show the truth. So she can't say, oh, well, it's because he's bigger on the platform because I'm bigger. <laughs> so I'll squash these people like little flies. Do you know what I mean? So JC hasn't got no power. Because she's talking about, like, obviously powerful influencers like TG's platform can attack her as well as JC's. So there's two two people's armies, in effect, who would go, who would go for it. <clears throat> but my platform is much bigger than these people's and um so there's nothing to be scared of yeah this person has a lot of power even though they've admitted i literally have the yeah, proof right now to come out and say Boom. i could literally come out with the proof but that's not me and i the the situation that everyone's coming out with I seen a, a middle-aged woman comment earlier on on, on um, one of these posts with this girl on and she wrote something like, why would JC need to do anything to anybody? He's good looking. So only uh, people who commit those types of crimes are always ugly. No. These people don't wear badges and they don't conform to a stereotypical person. That's what she wrote. He wouldn't need to do that. He'd get anybody. That's what she said is i did not bring this to tiktok i didn't want it to come to tiktok i didn't want anything to so come middle-aged woman in the comments um, this was said i told a person i trusted a person that i thought i was good friends with that i could tell anything to i told them what happened i didn't say the words that he's saying on this app um but i told him what happened the what's muddied the water is because she's saying no i haven't said i got grapes i didn't use that word so she's literally only putting that tip bit out and people are going well you're admitting he hasn't done anything then it's not just about being grapes is it you know what i mean you can be essayed you know what i mean like the the example i've put up i'm, I'm starting to think is, is the truth about the matter that they've agreed to both get frisky between the sheets they've fell asleep or whatever he's woke up in the night thinking he can go in for round two you know what I mean, is like obviously violated her in some way, you know, while she's like mid-sleep or something. And that could be where it comes in because she's saying, okay, yeah, we did have consensual you-know-what, but... So I'm thinking that but is that he's when in chance to look because he felt entitled that, well, we've done it once, so we can just do it again. It's the same night, so to speak, you know what I mean? But that's not the way it works. Detailed. I told him every detail. And I've got a recording of the said person agree it like i literally went through every detail yeah, did yeah. you not do this did you not do this did you not do this and he said yes 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 that all happened um so i've got that i've got so that. she's got a recording from the same conversation that jc uploaded it's a longer version than what jc's uploaded and in this she says well did you or did you not do this and he said yeah and, and she, she's got admissions on, on her phone you know what i mean so i can't wait for it it will come out because, you know, when the clout dies down and people lose interest in, in this case, for instance, 
she'll flare it back up again because she'll be used to all the attention because as much as people don't like don't like negative attention and any attention on this app is attention and clearly she set out with an agenda to begin with by sleeping with these big creators who are you know what i mean at a young age or whatever just knowing that it would cause some cloud so once the cloud dies down and people stop questioning her and go oh, well forget you you know what i mean you're not giving any information so on your own head bitch It'll, it will come out it will it's one of those things it really will and now that he's put that recording out how do you think she's going to feel that like he's manipulated his audience and cut his sentence off so it's going to come out don't worry about that that recording however it's not like i don't want that stress it's Listen, not about me yeah the, the i don't thing want is, it the, the thing and is, i've never what? once said i want to go to the police about this i said to birdman on the phone call i don't want nothing to come of this don't ever speak to me about this situation again and we me and birdman have spoken on the phone numerous of times since then about normal conversation why did jc go to the police don't make sense because he hasn't because he just said it because these creators always say that when they don't want to talk about something difficult it's a police matter can't talk on it to try and get people to stop talking about it the man's manipulating people he's manipulated this girl he's manipulating his audience he's attempting to but it doesn't wash with me and smart people so i hate this repetitive but he's been the police no he hasn't he has not been to the police Action. just because he says something doesn't make it true do you know what yeah. i mean he's never brought up this conversation and now all of a sudden for the since i've told him that he's he's been mentally ill it's been mentally affecting his health um he's not speedo went to the police who talked about speedo we're talking about jc and this girl so what speedo got to do with the situation please <laughs> totally different situation not thinking about it but however i've just spoke like he's the, like we've spoken on the phone for hours since then um yeah and he's trying to turn around and say the truth will come out and and then he's like oh she's coming on live and, and then all the jc little wet 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 women army will all get egg on the faces and i'll be rubbing it in and i'll go back to all the comments and i'll go uh-huh saying it's not true no i'm saying what's not true is i never said the words you're saying on live i never said them words yeah and i've, I've messaged yeah exactly speedo went to police on live because he was absolutely outraged and all that you know what i mean Where's any evidence of JC going to the police? Because he's the perpetrator, so he hasn't been to the police. He just told people that to shut them up. He wanted to shut people up. This is what these men do. They try and shut people up and control the situation. You are acting like men, and men don't do that, you know what I mean? And men are not abusers, you know what I mean? I know women can be as well, but I'm just saying in this situation, you're acting like, oh, no. <gasps> Never heard of a man abusing a woman and lying about it. Honestly, the per said person, I never said them words, and I never wanted anything to come on live. End of. Yeah. No. If I don't that. want, to, if I don't want to convict someone of something, that's my choice. I can easily do it. I've got recordings. I don't want to do that. Yeah. No. I could easily do it, but I don't well, want to. I'm not yeah. about that. It's not. I don't want to affect my mental health. You think different? Because you know, it? like, sh look how long you've been going through what your court case. It's it's mentally affecting, isn't it? Yeah. I don't want to do that. This is the thing, right, Alicia? She looks like Shea Lloyd. Do you remember Shea Lloyd after the X Factor years ago? She sounds like her too. Uh, the things on TikTok get spread like wildfire, right? It does. But but uh, all you can do is just be true to yourself. I. This is from my That's own what personal I'm doing. advice. Be true to yourself. And while it's happening, whatever negativity is coming, just keep deflecting it. Because at the end of the day, you are you are you you use this platform to promote your singing and you're spreading good exactly. vibes. Exactly. And, and, and you're growing as a person and you've got a lot of like good support exactly. uh, system. But unfortunately some that some Why has she got a mic because she's a singer? Somebody has and usually on the live she's singing she's not talking about drama or that so she has a microphone because she's a singer i told you this already it's used what you've uh, said anyone asks again about a microphone block them please moderator because they're just trying um, that already explained for the for own, clout. For the, yeah for their own because they're not doing well in the rankings like if i wanted to go to the police about anything i would have gone to the police yeah, if you, I have listen, the if right to not to go to the police. That's if, my decision. If you Just so you all know, that's TikTok, my decision. If you want to bring anything Thank to TikTok, you so much, Sam, for the hand Thank you. Person, exactly. Person.
But yeah. And everybody's saying in here, you need to tell the truth on this app. You, need, I don't need to do anything. I've said, like at the end of the day, I know my truth. JC knows the truth, and Birdman knows the truth. That's it. Nobody else. But how can she allow JC to put that version of events out there and cut the conversation on the phone call? Like I don't see how she isn't mad with rage and. Well, you know what I mean? Like, I would be putting that record now going, look, this is your precious JC, because he's proven him. She could prove him to be an absolute liar. Else needs to know anything. Um, yeah. JC's gone to the police. If I feel like I want to go to the police, no, I could. Hasn't. But I, in my opinion, for my own mental health, because I'm actually mentally stressed, um, people might not see that on here. Uh, I could turn around now and say, yeah, I've went to the police today. I've reported this situation because they're saying that they, they're not going to the police system, but I've reported it for investigation. And then just carry on. Like, and then I've said that out there. And then some people would travel to other lads going, Eva Queen's reported it. Yeah, Eva Queen's reported it. But I hadn't done anything like that. You know what I mean? It's very easy to lie. Why are you acting like a lie is not easy? The people who are arguing with it, you know what I mean? It's like, why are you acting like people can't lie? And why was an abuser admit to it on a social media platform? Um, they're going to profess their innocence, aren't they? But if she's got proof, hopefully she puts it out there. Or people don't like, at the end of the day, I can't win. If I'm on here... JC said he's gone to the police, you'll block babes. Member moderates, anyone saying JC's gone to the police, let's block them because I've explained it about 50 times now, all live yesterday, all this live today, and I'm not repeating myself anymore. Acting. JC's not being to the police, he's an absolute liar, and anyone who says different gets blocked. My abuser admitted it. Well, you're black, love, because we don't have people who've been abused around here. Now I am off live. People are going to say you're doing it for clout. Um, yeah, that's a thing. What, if I'm on here right now, people are going to say, oh, you're on here for clout. If I'm not on here, people are going to say you're doing it for clout. At the end of the day, I can't ah, win. Ah, ah. Um, I'm just trying to bring yeah, positivity sir. to my actual view. Liar. What happened with We'll have all the exclusive hints. Then this week's delusion. Thank you so much, Chicken Tender. Choo choo! This week's delusion. Simon Cowell? Something to do with Simon Cowell? What happened with Simon Cowell? Nothing at all. That's for me to know. And you to find out. <laughs> what happened to Eminem? Shine like a star. Do you think Simon Cowell's gonna release any record with, with some nut job going shine like a star? You know what I mean? When he's got like a big talent show of this, that and the other, you think he's gonna stand in let's see how they stand for some up front of him and go shine like a star. Uh, 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 uh. Like ridiculous. Cause you are, you are, you are, you are. She's got the X Factor. She's gonna shine just like... So she's trying to say she's gonna uh, be on the X Factor with Simon Cowell. Like, absolutely crazy. Absolute nut. Like the star. She's gonna shine like a star. And he's not gonna buy one of those paintings, come off her, you know what I mean? He's got a child. Thank you so much, Bryony. A child could uh, sc scribble better than she can do any art, so... He'd just uh, put one of those up. Gonna Simon Cowell. If he thinks I've got the X Factor, baby. What happened with Simon Cowell? Honestly, a, a, a nut. A registered nut. Friends, like I keep saying... No like that. I'm so good at it. I can ignore it. I can choose to mirror it. I can choose to ignore it. That's how it works. So, you want to treat me like shit? I'll mirror your behaviour and show you exactly what you're doing. But do you think anyone cares whether you mirror anyone's behaviour? You're just triggered and, and reacting to people. People are loving it. Do you think scolding people in your chat or, or saying that they're sitting around like laughing and their heads off, you know what I mean? Because Alphabet skittered me, haha. You know, these people are not offended or like will not be affected by you saying, well, I'm going to mirror you and be nasty to you and tell you all about yourself because these people are children. And they're going to be laughing, going, oh my god, screen recording, showing all the mates. It won't be like a, ah ha ha, you got read, read by alphabet. It'll be, oh my god, ah ha, you know what I mean? They laugh at you. So no one's going to affect, be affected by your um, retorts or whatever you got to say back to people. You won't like it. And you won't like <laughs> it. Like, anyone cares? <laughs> <laughs> 
Babe. Snotting everywhere. You're an edit account. You can't even show your face, babe. You're not even worth talking to. You're blocked. Do you know what I mean? It's like, oh god, 700 people here too. 700? Oh my god, someone's fell off. 700 viewers? They're out. I haven't got time. Got mascara on my fucking eyes. Mascara on your eyes is the least of your <clears> problems, <throat> believe me. Do you know what? Thank you, Queen Bob. The great, great chance to get rid of unwanted attention in this chat. Which is actually great for me. I can't watch for three minutes while he's self procrastinating. So I've been sent the. Oh, look, our little son of the chat. You know, we always send subscriptions and everything, San H. Look. Jogger cargo bottoms. Oh. So let's pop them on let's and see look. what they look like. These are 100% uh, polycotton. So the nicest dress you material. I got a size large, they do come in small, medium, large, extra large and extra, extra large. So let's pop them on and see what they look like. She's got a Pandora bracelet on. No, I am not going to lie, these are the most comfortable pants I have ever had on. They are absolutely beautifully oh. made. They're beautiful, you've got nice deep pockets, you've got your side working pocket as well. So the cargo look, you've got your elasticated bottom, you've got an elasticated waist. I got a size large, probably could have sized down, but I like being comfortable, so I always stay to what size I am. A working toddle, comes in loads of different colours. I did get the white pair, a bit of a gamble, but I did get the white pair as well. Absolutely. In love with these, and I wouldn't say they were poly cotton. What are they? <laughs> What's poly cotton? The polyester and elastane. So they're like a poly cotton, but they are really thick as well. They're not your thin, as you can hear. You know, they're not your thin material. So let's have a look and see what the white pearl is. Like. They're an ideal length as well. They're not too short, they're not too long. So if you're taller than, say, five, six, I'd say these wouldn't be for you. Well, when we see San H, that's a follower. Thank you, Creating Creations. Hello, babe. Dan? Yeah, I'm just going to show you some colouring. Oh, yeah, I'm going to show you some colouring. I've got you some colouring. Oh, God, she's not going to like that. I've got you some colouring. What? <laughs> colouring. She's going to think you're talking to her like a child. Let me get one out. There we go. I can't imagine this is going to go down well. Colour it in. I'm fucking sure to. <laughs> I passed it fucking years ago. <laughs> go on, do it. Look, I'll show you. What? I'll show you what to do. I know what to do, I'd bum me fucking do. <laughs> Don't you want to have a little go? Look. Hey? Look how fun it is. I can't hear what you're saying. Look how fun it is. Look how fun it is. Fucking fun. <laughs> Boring. <laughs> <laughs> Look. Yeah, boring. Do you want to have a go? No, thank you. This is so good. Fucking horrible. Would I'm you look? Gonna read. You'd rather read, would you? You'd rather read. Yeah. I think this is fantastic. Look, you're still a child. Look how good this is. Would you like a try? No. Thanks. No. It comes with loads of pens. I knew she wouldn't like. Look it. how many pens you get. You get more sheets as well with animals. Do you want I, a little try? I do like to colour in. I don't colour in, but I, I like. I used to like colouring in, obviously, years ago and stuff. But I could literally sit and colour in. No. Okay. Next time I get on a flight, I might colour in. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I knew she wouldn't like that. Hey, Angie. It's all coming together. See you later, that you'll be working with Simon Cowell. Absolute poppycock. Thank you, Sobriety Jack. Absolute poppycock. Uh, very nicely. I'm being a bit private and I want to come. What happened with Sam and Carl? The X Factor, babe. Oh, for the music. All the working with... He loves me. Oh, yeah, it's the only one. I've all the working with Simon Cowell all for the music. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. They are going to be so affected. Literally. Shit. I can't wait. Let them think that I'm talking... 
That's all I'm gonna say. Let them carry on. What happened to TikTok coming into your living room? Remember, they were travelling all the way from China to come and have a meeting with her in the living room. You know, we've had so many lies. You were doing a duet with Eminem the other week. Beyonce named a boat after the other week after. You know, Gucci copied your pyjamas. Like, you're absolutely insane. The woman has gone nuts. Thinking that I'm talking I'll be a millionaire this year. Whatever, Trevor. She's such a liar. I'll be a millionaire this year. No, you won't. Roots. So, carry on begging it up, darling. If Chelsea's artwork and her scarves are that good, why does she never wear them herself? Why does she never wear these headscarves herself? Like, even the samples she's got, why isn't she like, oh my god, my art's on there. I love it so much, I'm gonna put it on my head for life. Like, why is she still wearing the designer headscarves when hers are meant to be so good, you know what I mean? Yeah, at least I'll be able to help some of you lot out and get you down the fucking leaderboard, sweet. You wouldn't help anyone. Oh, it depends who I favour. She'd step over you sooner look at you. I'll just say you can put makeup on a pig and it'll still be a pig. You confess to not brushing your teeth, love, so we know you're sitting there hanging with the terrible um, mouth us situation going on. I think he really thinks he's gorgeous. What? I put a bag on. I do have a bag. No, they meant a, a brown paper bag. They didn't mean that type of bag. They meant a brown paper one with little eyes and a little mouth. Oh my god, the underarms. Right. <coughs> <coughs> that is the eyes. Terrible. Yes, yes. Some of these are repeats because what sometimes they get taken out. You hardly had numbers until you were I can't believe she it. meant Matt has has a chat with herself about still being awake. <laughs> Go to bed, Matata. Why are you still awake? Why? Just tell me why are you still awake? How can you keep going and going and going? Come on. Get off now, go to bed, my tata. Leave the world alone. You're not famous, my tata. Nobody cares. No one's interested in you, my tata. Nobody likes you. you so At least she's telling the truth. It is not true. Am I going to The delusional kooky monster thinks Simon Cowell is buying her painting. So strong. <laughs> Fucking beast, mate. So this is the posh water that they make. But if you spell it backwards, it says naive. I wonder if there's a colour code on this. Oh. Your mum's tacky, that's why you've come out the way you have. Honest to God. Absolute little gremlin. Oh. oh my God. Is she serious? Let's listen to that again. I wonder if there's a colour code on this. Oh. Your mum's tacky, that's why you've come out the way you have. Absolute little gremlin. Gremlin. Oh. It's gremlin, not gremlin. And everyone backwards is not and spelling naive either. No. Oh yes, darling. She makes a new live every week. 
Simon Cowell also loves my own. Mm. I no. was very Nobody loves your art. Intrigued by one of my paintings. And uh, he's probably going to buy it. Uh, but I'm going to make a deal with him, so I'm going to bag half the money and half the money I'm going to give to charity. Oh, God. That old chestnut. Because he's rich, so he's, 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 I'm just sorting it out. We'll have all the content coming soon. But I won't be going live like this, so you have to make the most of me because I'm going to be real famous soon. Holy boy, thank you. So, pull your car to the people that never believed in me. Try to bring me down, slag me off. You're talking out your when you dare, But on Google, my face comes up. That's how f***ing I'm become. I'm not kidding. That's crazy. Like, you... Literally, you could just search it up for now, and it will fully just come up with my face, along with Cynthia Reeve and Ariana Grande. So you can best believe when Ariana Grande is looking me up, my face is gonna pop up. Do you kind of get it now? Like how? F so what she's saying is, if if Ariana Grande does a Google search on the word alphabet because she's in the new film Wicked or whatever, that she'll automatically see Alphabet's face because it shows up. So it's just very strange, isn't it? I see thousands of people's face every day when I'm scrolling through the FYP, you know what I mean? I don't know who any of them are. No, I'm sorry, I, I, I try and grab myself, of course, like, I'm very grateful, but holy shit, someone probably already seen me in that movie set. Be honest, when you search for Alphabet, all of you, go on your Google right now and type in Alphabet. No other things, just type it up on Google, Google, search bar, and put yes in the chat with green heart if I pop up. I'll do it right now. Wait, I should write it. Could you pass me a phone? Yeah, yeah. So you can imagine, imagine if Ariana Grande just typed in Alpha. Well, I can do it right now live. Somebody said that they just tried. Just type the word alphabet in. There she is. I've got Google, I'm just, I'd be showing up. The directors, I would be showing up. Now, I didn't call myself Alphaba. I was actually named Alphaba. Because my mum knew I loved the show so much. So she called me Alphaba because I came out as trans. When you type in Alphaba on Google, it, my face comes up. I'm getting a personal. These all live in Cloud Kuhula. So I've got like six weeks, I'm gonna go in. Like, what the? Um, I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna Brazilian. Well, like, he's got big fat ones around his legs are huge, man. And I found the guy that's bigger than me. Love all the booyaka in the Brazilian. Oh my god, it's so fat. It's like mixed race, you know, like, oh, sexy as <laughs> Baby, be like, booyaka, booyaka with the big ones, a crew. Booyaka, booya is Brazilian. Passing troll. Love Brazilian, man. So hot, so, so strong. No. Oh yes, <laughs> I'm getting a personal trainer. So I've got like six weeks. I'm gonna go in. Like, uh, are you thinking? What I'm thinking, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> so Jack was a bit of a Lothario, he travelled around Brazil, so I always mess around and go, don't you mention that Brazil again? And the fact that he's talking about uh, Brazil, it, it comes straight to my mind, so... <laughs> I just say to him, don't you mention that Brazil? What? I'm gonna be going for dinner with him, huh? Oh god, I can't listen to a lie anymore. I'm not allowed to say it. No, he's not allowed to mention any, any travels in Brazil. Because he was going with women out there, love. I've got earrings, by the way. Do you want to see the earrings? So, obviously, I haven't got, like... So, I always say, I'm only joking when I say it. Like, I go, don't you mention that Brazil, even when he's not. He'll talk about something else. And I go, don't you mention that Brazil? And you go, I'm not. <laughs> Mama Kaz ranting about me. Oh, let's see what the cloud chase is saying now, love. 200 views, about right. I drop my phone, people want to sit there and because I've not had, you know, I'm, I'm not, a, I'm not um, a post op trans woman and I'm pre op, it's turned into a big thing. I make sure that my things are tucked away right. and I drop my phone. Someone, I'm someone with nephews, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a godmother, I've got, you know, I've got mothers with kids on here. Do not try and twist such a sick agenda and sit there and say, Mum and Kaz was sitting there with no underwear on on her life, because that's not what, what it was. 
So this is how twisted some people can be. Hello. And you're sitting there posting videos of me on TikTok, which can, which I which I will tell you, I'm not giving you the permission to do that. So the fact that you're trying to imply that I was naked and you're wanting to see that and share it, I want to see it. I feel threatened. You're more of the predator, darling. You got people sitting there calling me a predator because I dropped my phone on a live stream. And I'm wearing I'm a dress. See the predator so predator. if you do see this video on FYP, please, please, please report it. I'm Evil to. queen, go and suck yourself with your Russell burger between your legs, darling. That's half broken. That you've got to pour, put a whole fucking tub of KY jelly in. Yeah, because you're dry. Don't talk about me, darling. Um, mommy boyfriend's in the chat and can verify that um, it's just literally uh, a lightly coated finger's worth. To allow friction to still occur and not be too too slippery, so yeah, he wouldn't know because he hasn't got one. You see, because my sorry about that. <laughs> it's just absolutely disgusting. What it is is, guys, right? Is on this app, on this app, what people like to do is they like to try and tarnish you it with the same brush. Much. They there like to go. sit there and wait <laughs> for you to slip up, or for you to make a mistake, and they're going to be the first person to either I made you the mud jack so I can see your name queen with your broken um with your broken down below. Um, Jack, uh, is my down below broken? My boyfriend's literally in the chat, you know, three times a day, sometimes twice on a, a slow day. Right, you're now fucking paid off some next man that was on a TV show splashing his fucking willy And you're asking to see my down below parts Commenting on videos saying can I see the full censored version We've all seen your Now it works wonders, there we go love At least, at least I've got a nice boyfriend Russell. Yours cheats on you with men Okay, because if we really really did We'll be researching what a rustler burger looks like Okay, so when, when just so you know, everybody, if you do want to see a picture, can somebody write my Twitter? It's Chelsea underscore Harwood, and you'll be able to see Jack producing a money shot on me. That's there for free, and you can also see my everything if you want to have a little look, um, just to disprove. You know what I mean? I'd show it if I could, but you'll have to find it yourself. There we go. If we could pin that, go and have a little check and come back to me with your comments threaten me you want to sit there and judge every single other trans woman or any other trans person because you're sad within yourself that's the that's that's the reality of how could i possibly sad be, be sad within myself you know what i mean i've got a very enriched life i have thousands of viewers every day i get gifted hundreds of pounds a week you know what i mean i make thousands a month um across two profiles i've got near enough two thousand subscribers uh, which I get a couple of grand from as well. I've got a lovely boyfriend who spoils me, buys me designer dresses, uh, designer perfumes, bloody YSL handbags, 100 red roses, you know. I get lavished with positive attention. Um, and you've got nothing, you know what I mean, apart from a black t-shirt and um, a hair clamp. Vulnerable. Why are you asking to... Trying to cover your, um, your recession. You wanted to see my down below area. Who's the predator, dog? I want to see. I want somebody to send me the picture of the flash, and I'll put it in my Discord so everyone can see. Thank you so much, Danny. As someone that hasn't gone through the process, and you've come out like that, babe. I'm on. Listen, I'm not even on Gucci the wireless glasses, update, darling. Mine's still downloading. Right? I'm not even hit a hundred percent fucking charge. I've not even Megatron fucking prime. So this um, just goes to show, you know what I mean, like referencing the transition as an ios upgrade and things like that thank you so much free spirits just goes to show how unserious he is about ever getting any type of surgery because you would speak about it with more delicacy you know what i mean and obviously um he's sitting there and chatting about ios uploads and megatrons and this that and the other so clearly he's got no clue whatsoever about anything to do with transition so i'm the Voldemort. you're coming to expel your miss a bitch and you're sitting there asking. Do you reckon he thinks he's hilarious? You know, when he comes out with all these, like, um, bottom feeder insults. Thank you, Jelly, so much for the diamond tree. Do you think he actually sits there and thinks, oh, I'm dead funny, me? Like, when he's just, like, as dry as my, my chuff without a bit of um, a slither of you know what? Yeah. Oh, suck yourself, you absolute cheese string. Well, I can't actually do that, uh, but you probably could if you stuck your legs over your head, you know what I mean? And maybe lean forward a bit. Yet. You ain't special. Ah, yeah, you ain't special. nice. Yeah. You got a pain man to fiddle with you. Like I said, don't. My things work perfectly, darling. Ugh. Mine's all lubricated. Mine's. Ugh. 
he's literally talking about his derriere pipe. Ugh, prolapsed. Thank you so much, Jenna. Wayne. This is too much. Right? Thank All you, right Jenna. then. If you ain't got that KKY jelly lock and loaded, that shit ain't gonna do nothing, darling. So don't sit. I think Jack had begged to differ because uh, we have actually dry effed as well, you know what I mean? Oh, yes, love. We'll have all the dry up there. Oh, I love it, but it's what you lot are. Narcissistic. <laughs> yeah. I love it when they try and come for me, you know. It gives me, like, uh, lots of opportunity to uh, make them look very stupid. Small, egotistical, little, dirty, rusty rats. That's exactly what you are, darling. So Ooh, you're hard. <laughs> this app. You're hard. And let me tell you something. There's seven bitches on my hit list, and you're fucking one of them. Yeah? And let me tell you something now. You're not even a passing thought in my mind, so I'm so glad that I live rent free in your head. Um, and I've made this list of seven. Ow. She's one of them. Absolute rats. <laughs> fucking streaming me. Yeah, fucking stream me. I'll give you all your fucking. Everybody go over and do the report because obviously this is violating the terms of the app, you know what I mean? Saying all these terrible things. So type in Mama Cars and hit that report button for harassment and bullying, love. We'll have no harassing on TikTok. We must keep TikTok a safe place, love. If it's not your little brat friend backing you up, then who else is it? Oh, he's jealous You're all of running around now. in a little ring. None of you are, are leaders. None of you are shepherds, yeah, in that fucking pack. You're all little sheep. You're all sheep because you all follow one another, okay? You all followed Miss Red and look at the state of you all. Without your little FYP show, without you streaming us, who the fuck are you? You're well, nobody actually streams him, to be honest. When do we ever see him in the FYP? He never makes it on the FYP. And the only time he ever comes on live is to go, da -da -da. I think maybe he's had an argument with uh, Papa Dean, maybe. And he's feeling emotional. I think what happens is, because him and Papa Dean argue all the time, they've got an unstable relationship and a toxic relationship, that whenever Papa Dean's been with another man or something, then he comes on and lashes out at everybody else. Thank you, Patsy. It's very sad, isn't it? Unpredictable, to be honest. We're both sticking out each other's Gucci's. Because without each other, where's your back in? You gotta back each other. Alright, you gotta sit there and roll off each other's thing with your push that fake FYP narrative. Let's be honest. Cause you both wanna push out your controlled narrative of of F Ha ha ha, thank you, my darlings, he got banned. Ha 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 ha. My evil plan worked. Ha ha ha. And next time you come on, given hate about me, the same thing will happen. Ah, 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 ah. No, 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 no. You got banned. Right. Back on with the FYP. Elphaba shows off his summary clip on earrings from Claire's. Honestly, these earrings, like Pat Butcher style. He looks like a middle aged um, shop assistant in the charity shop. You know, when they hire the special people to um, to save behind the counter to give them a sense of purpose. Like, he, he looks like he'd be one of those people that you'd walk on the, like, you know what I mean, behind the till. You want to see the earrings? So, obviously, I'm on, like, a work experience like, from the YMCA. These are kind of cute, something can, like... Four pounds. Do you see how, look how cute these look? They look terrible. Makes a look, doesn't it? It's crazy. Well, you're lying about not being able to find me Twitter because people are posting the username there, love. So you can see everything on there. And I have the other site as well. It's on the Instagram bio if you want to watch the videos. Okay. So this is what we look like so far. What are we feeling? Move this down. Or I give my nana earrings back. Well, I don't know if your nana shops at Claire's, but that's interesting. Actually, nans do shop at Claire's. Mess. Oh my god, Elphaba's favourite hygiene products. How would you have, um, oh, Mama Kaz's back? Go back again and do it again. Everyone go back and do it again. Here we go. Buying this is cheese great. string. Without, you, you all have to have go something do it behind again. you. I don't need nothing behind me. 
You've got Listen, no one, that's why. I roll on, I roll on my bonds. I'm fine with that. I don't need to associate myself in little. So he's jealous of our friendships with each other. Groups, yeah. You know, I'm, I'm perfectly fine. I've been on here long enough. He has to have to the fan on because he's overloaded. Did you say? That I absolutely love. You know, I mean, my regulars that come and see regulars, me. Regulars, huh? Whether you don't see me as much as you used to. That's fine. That's yeah. So there you go. So um, obviously, um, this male specimen was saying derogatory things about my um, undercracker department. You know what I mean. So if you do want a free preview, then it's there for you to see. You know what I mean. Chelsea underscore Harwood on Twitter, and you also get to see my boyfriend's um, thing. You know what I mean as well. It's fine. And a money shot on my tum tum. She's another one, to be honest. But we'll save that for another day. It looks so good. Yeah, jealousy. It's these people, you see. Because I, I was on a TV show years ago, everybody, in 2016, 2015. And um, I had corrective surgery done. Because uh, my initial uh, transition surgery was done on the NHS. And um, they didn't do a very, very good job of it. So I had corrective surgery. Yeah, see, that, that, that's disgusting. Um, I had corrective surgery and I appeared on a TV show. So what they do is they, they use the before picture because obviously there's going to be a before um, and obviously then an after. But they try and use the before picture. But I was on the show called Celebrity Botched Up Bodies. Um, I'm proud of that fact, love. So, yeah, um, while my 27-year-old boyfriend um, loves my, you know what, I'm perfectly comfortable with it too. I know, guys, other than that, I'm so bored. That's like me putting a picture up of him as a boy, you know what I mean, five years ago or something, and going, ah, ha, 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 look what you used to look like, you know what I mean, like sad weirdos. Jealous. Oh, because he hasn't got one. There you go, evil queen. This is the real people. I don't have to pay these people, darling. Thank you, Chantel. As much as, as, much as whatever you guys try to do. Thank you, Curse, my darling. Thank you, Kurt. Thank you, 777. Thank you, Neymar. Thank you, Tracy. Thank you, TikTok. Thank you, Leslie. I love you too. Thank What's you, he getting Penny Roses? Thank you, um, TikTok. We love you, Puke the Grudge. We love you, Gemma. Look at that, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We love you all. So, yes. Um, back on Where to <laughs> light-hearted shit. Can everyone please tap the screen and share the live for me? Oh yeah, we're not watching himself procrastinate. If he st if he gets back onto the topic of me, let me know and then we'll watch. Um, right. Thank you so much, racing girl. Choo choo. Thank you so much, my darling. Thank you, beautiful. Right. I'm gonna write an emoji in the chat, and I've uh, put a shop video up. I wanted to get to um 500 likes and share. So when you like it, make sure to press the arrow and share and pin. My comments are right high. Let's see if it comes. There you go. Pin that and go there, and then we'll get back on with the FYP. But I'm not pressing play until we get that done. So, so once you've done that, let me know. Make sure to share it though as well, because I want the shares from now on instead. And um, <clears throat> then we'll get on with the rest of the show. <laughs> Thank you. It says not found because you're blocked on that account, you know what I mean? It will say not found for you. <laughs> yeah, you're blocked, you see. I'm just me. Anyone who can't see it, don't you worry. I'm not talking about you. No, I'm not unblocking anybody. You're blocked for a reason on that account. If you're a different person here, that's up to you. Yeah, it's the sat nav thing. I want you to like and share it for me, please. And once it's on 500, let me know. And you've got to share as well. Nearly yeah, 500. Yeah, you've got to share as well, though. I want you to repost. I want you to repost as well. I want the sat nav thing. I swear it's sick. It's 40 quid. And it's not a sat nav, it's a mirror of your phone. So you can play your music through it. Um, if you've got a car, for instance, that hasn't got, it's only got a CD player, you know, because not everyone's got brand new cars. If you've got a CD player and you want to convert it to, like, a screen, like in the modern cars or whatever, then it's got an aux wire, it's got, a, it goes into the cigarette light and it gives you two ports to charge your mobiles off as well. 
and um, it's got Spotify, it's got your messages, WhatsApp, everything. So it's just the direct mirror of your phone, and it comes through your speakers in the car. And um, do you know, like, if you, if you put the radio station on a crackly station, which has got nothing on it, and then you put the same in the, on the on the screen, it just plays all your music and everything as well. And it's only forty quid. Thank you, Nick Tuck. Thank you so much for the corgi. And it's only forty quid. So yeah, let me know when it's on 500 likes and make sure to repost the video as well when you like it, if you don't mind. I've got one of the goods. Ah, oh, I love it. I love it. So it's only 40 quid, so make sure to grab it before it sells out because obviously because I'm advertising it actively. Um, We'll have all the sales. Yeah, it can play videos while you're driving or whatever as well, but obviously that's not recommended. But maybe if it's for the kids and not you to watch. Now it's on the account that I'm going to write high on, high on and pin now. I wrote hi, yes. Yeah, I'll pin that account. It's on this one. Somebody write me Twitter as well in the comments. Thank you, Nanny Pepper. Thank you for the subscription. Is he talking about me again? Let's see. If he's not, you're getting blocked for lying. Oh, thank you. No, he's battling. So can we block that person next so they can't lie again on my profile? The one who said he was talking about me again? Because you just wasted my time. Thank you, Nick. Oh, it's on 5 for 5. Okay, let's go. I thought this was amazing last night. This lovely Irish woman got pulled up onto the stage in Adele's show in uh, Munich from Ireland. And she's just so excited. It's, it's absolutely hilarious. What's your name? Little Jenny. What's your name? You're British, I can tell. No, I'm Irish. Oh, you're Irish. <laughs> oh, sorry. Irish. I expect you to be Irish. Okay. Come here. What's, what's your name? What's your name? Paula, and who are you here with tonight? I know this. Where have they gone? They've gone back down. Who are you here with? My husband Frank. Your husband Frank. <laughs> what one's Frank? In the white top. Oh, I see him. <laughs> He's getting you for second. So oh, the there he is. He's out of the bar. <laughs> Frank from Ireland. I've got your crazy wife Paula up here with me. <laughs> How many proseccos have you had, Paula? One or two. One or two, you feel that? You're all right. I'm getting drunk after this show too. <laughs> When did, you, when did you get to Munich? Uh, we got to Frankfurt yesterday. Oh, lovely. And then we got the train down to Munich last night. Oh my gosh. And whereabouts in Ireland are you? Little place called Kildare. Kildare, I've never heard of that. What's it in the bar? In the bar. What's it near where I might know? Um, Dublin. Oh, near Dublin. Okay, well, I know that. Shoot. Has someone got your phone? Did you give somebody your phone? No, I think you, you, you walked a long way. Here he is. Let's come up here, Paula, and we will get. We will, we will get a picture. <laughs> <laughs> you're, the most, you're the most excited person I've been having on stage. But you know what? If it was Beyonce, I'd be the same. It's not Beyonce. Look at the camera. Pose, pose. Is that right? How many years back? Yes. I love her. You got the whole thing, you got the whole thing. Right, oh, we've got your sunglasses. Oh, don't worry about them. Right. I could not use them because the lights are so oh. Woo! Okay, we're a bit slow for my big head. Right, and how long are you in Munich for? When do you go home? Tomorrow. Home tomorrow, okay. Lovely. All right, well, so do I. Um, I have a goodie bag here oh. for you. Let's go get it. It's got some merch. <laughs> There's people who are killjoys, you know, and they're slagging the, the Irish woman off going, you can tell Adele feels uncomfortable. Adele was laughing her heads off, you know what I mean? Like, oh my God, like, she's the most excitable fan I've ever had on the stage. Like, Adele's not a nasty person. She's not going to be horrible about this woman because she was a bit excited, you know what I mean? She even said herself, it was. I suppose if it was Beyonce, I'd be exactly the same, you know what I mean? So, like, there's people like, it seems like Adele felt uncomfortable. Oh, respect Adele's personal space and all that. Oh, bugger off, you killjoys. Honest to God, these some of some people in these comments really wound me up. And look at this as well. 
over all the phones. No one's actually enjoying the moment. Look at her. And then look at this years what ago. What about who you sing it for me? No phones. Well, there is actually one phone, I've just seen there. But, you know, it's not as much. Um, okay, so Dog Nanny Liverpool. Dog Nanny Liverpool. So, this is my Dog Nanny, and she's going really viral on TikTok at the moment. Um, thank you so much, me and enemy. This video had 2,471 likes. And, um, like, loads, loads of thousands of hits. So, yeah, she's amazing, and I'm so glad that she's doing really well. And make sure to follow her, Dog Nanny Liverpool. Excuse me. Yeah. Are you that Dog Nanny off TikTok? Yes, Thank you, sure, Machinery. Um, do you take Excel Bully? Someone wants to know. I don't know. I'm sorry, mate. Look, I had a really bad experience in the park one time when a bit one of our dogs was sort of like sort of like really bad experience. And we had to call the police. We had to go to the emergency vet. It was a nightmare. I mean, insurance on them is absolutely sky high. It's just not. Yes, yeah, Alison. I'm afraid, babe. I'm so sorry. I don't take them. Really, really sorry. They are lovely. Not all Excel Bullies are bad. I've got nothing against them. Nothing against the owners or whatever. For me personally, though. Like, I just can't take them, it's just too much of a high risk for me, I'm so sorry. But our Penny will play with any dog at all, she just loves all dogs, she loves Sappies, German uh, Spotted Pointers, Rhodesian Ridgebacks, she loves all kinds of dogs, she's amazing. The Observer, providing you with the latest TikTok drama from across the UK.